Stadium in Athens, Georgia, a stadium named for Dr. Stedman Vincent Sanford, an early major force behind Georgia athletics. And now we bring you the coin toss. It's presented by Nissan, innovation that excites. Georgia is lined up to kick the ball off first, and we are ready to go. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. He's to the 40. He's at midfield. And they finally push him out at the 29. Perfectly run option keeper. Not what you'd expect when you prepare all week to defend the option. But then again, give this offense some credit. These guys aren't exactly the scout team. First and 10 following that big run. He's scrambling. He's at the 20. Tackle at the 17. I'm telling you, quarterbacks who can run the ball are so hard to stop. You have to scheme around them, which takes the best coverages out of your defensive playbook. And down he goes at the 9. That makes it second and 2. From the nine yard line. Second down. 17, Mike, Mike 17. Ready. 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 Under pressure. Boy, was he drilled as he let go of that football. Yeah, he's going to feel that one tomorrow. McBride gets a carry left side. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Really good job by the big guys up front to use their size and speed and get the runner in the backfield. Fourth down. This should be an easy field goal. UAB is looking to go up by three. Kicks up, and they tack on three points. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He's to the 20. And he's tackled at the 30-yard line. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. He's taken down right around the 40. From their own 40-yard line, it's second down. And he's tackled at about the 43-yard line. Complete for three yards, and that's good for a first down. Good look there from the quarterback, dumping it off and coming away with a new set of downs. Brought down at the 46-yard line. He gets another set of downs, and more importantly, opens up a whole host of play-calling possibilities for the coaching staff. First and 10, ball on the 46-yard line. And a nice catch there before he stepped out of bounds. I'll tell you something, I'm loving this quarterback's confidence more and more as this game goes on. He's really throwing the ball with some purpose. Cook on the handoff. Out of bounds. 
Jones right around the 14 yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 14 yard line. After a decent pickup. Quick strike to the receiver. He's tackled at the three. And this is the eighth play of the drive. He's taken down right around the two-yard line. That brings him second and goal. Second down, goal to go. Two yards to the end zone. White off the right side. Tackle made at the two-yard line. Tenth play of the drive. Short yardage defense here. Touchdown, Bulldogs. There are some guys when they get near the goal line, they just have a knack for getting the ball into the end zone. That's what we saw right there. Nice play to take the three-point lead here early in the first quarter. The question now is if they can build off this momentum later in the game. And he hits the PAT. A 10-play, 70-yard drive. And a touchdown as a result. The score now, 7-3. Georgia to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. And they make the stop at the 38-yard line. From their own 38-yard line, it's first down. Scrambling around. They'll bring him down around the 41-yard line. Three yards there on the quarterback keeper. From their own 48-yard line, first down. He fights forward to about the 49. He's going to try and scramble. He's tackled in the open field. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. Let's see if they can keep the drive alive here. He makes it out to maybe the 43-yard line. That was nose-to-nose -nose football right there, and the defense this time wins the battle. Little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. 
So it's time to see this offense go to work again. This defense couldn't stop them from moving the ball and inevitably finding the end zone. Georgia holds a four-point lead. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. That's a great tackle at the 27. yard line. First down. Makes a catch and he's got nowhere to go. That'll make it second to seven. at the 38. So we're looking at another third down here. They'll get him for a loss. Georgia is up four. It's away, and it's a booming punt. From the 15, he makes it to the 25-yard line. Georgia's got people flying all over the field on defense right now. Boy, they sure do. Right now, we're just seeing great defensive effort. They have a plan. They understand it. They're playing with great speed, and they're not giving up big plays. That's why they're playing well up to this point. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. He's into the open field, and he hits him hard at the 34-yard line. It's second down now. They're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Give to the tailback. Loss of two by the halfback. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. Pittman was the intended target on the play. So that'll make it fourth down. The defense held their ground on that play. The quarterback just wasn't able to find any open receivers. The punt upcoming, and they're going to come after this one. Looking for the corner. He makes it out to maybe the 43-yard line. So you wonder what kind of excitement we'll see this time around. Makes it out to about the 46. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 46. Georgia is up by four. Up the middle for a nice game.
There are three quarters remaining. The Bulldogs lead it by four. And we're ready for more football here in quarter number two. Makes it out to about the 29. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 29. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. He works the right side. It's first and ten. Ball on the 17 yard line. Here we go. They hand it off. The five. Touchdown, Georgia. And once again, he finds the end zone. That's his second rushing touchdown of the game. That was just an excellent individual effort to find the end zone. Splits the uprights with the extra point. A six-play, 57-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. Boy, this offense right now is just being physical, really controlling the line of scrimmage, and it's opening up some nice big lanes for the running backs. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. Five wide. Now he's scrambling, and down he goes at the 26-yard line. From their own 26-yard line, second down. He's scrambling, runs with it, and he's got room. He's to the 40. He's taken down at the 46. I'm telling you, quarterbacks who can run the ball are so hard to stop. You have to scheme around them, which takes the best coverages out of your defensive playbook. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 46. He gets out to about the 44-yard line. Room around the corner. Knocked out of bounds around the 40-yard line. It's second down, six to go. Ball on the 40. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Runs it and tackled in the backfield. Where in the world was he going on that run? Well, that's a good question. I thought for a while he got his directions messed up. He'll try to knock this punt down inside the 20. He punts. No, he won't. Fires in a hurry. Interception. And down he goes at the 28-yard line. First and ten. 
Ball on the 28-yard line. Nice run, and he's brought down. They'll spread the field with five wide. Here's a run. Brought down around the 37-yard line. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. And they're going to have to bring on the punt team. Great hold by the defense. They were expecting the pass play, and they defended it very well. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. He's out to the 30. He makes it out to maybe the 33-yard line. We'll have to see now how the offense responds this time after throwing a pick on their last drive. The game is in danger of getting out of hand early. It's very, very important that they not only hang on to the football this drive, but they also need to get a score on the board as well. Slides down. So the keeper goes for about seven yards. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Feeds it to the back. They go to the left for a nice game. That makes it first and ten. Makes it to the 45 yard line. The running back gets a yard, maybe less. That makes it second and From their own 45 yard line, second down. Hand off inside, and they'll get him in the backfield. Brought down, nothing doing. Jackson awaiting the return. Brought down at the 24. The defense really stepped up to force that three and out on the last drive. About the 35. First and 10. Ball on their own 35. They come out on an empty backfield. Tackle made at the 32 yard line. The offense couldn't get those linemen blocked, and they'll lose yards. Well, here the defensive linemen did a great job at sealing up the hole at the line of scrimmage. Quick throw to the back, it's incomplete. You know, sometimes the toughest throws to make for a quarterback is when he has a wide receiver wide open, and everybody in the stands is saying, throw it, throw it, and you aim the football instead of just getting back in rhythm, stepping, and throwing. And that time, he aimed the ball, and it was incomplete. He's in trouble. Passes back across his body, but nobody there. Not enough strength on that pass, and it hits the turf. Oh, boy, he wishes he had that play to do over. Could have been big yardage there. They're stacking the line. It looks like they're coming after this punt. Booming kick. Yeah. 
He gets out to about the 38-yard line. They're ready to begin another drive. He fights forward to about the 39. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 39-yard line. Gets to about the 41-yard line. Spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlook. And he's level at the 49 yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 49 yard line. And he's tackled at the 46 yard line. Hands it off inside, brought down. Third down again. They come out in a five wide set. Here's the throw, and I don't think he got anything on that. Here's the punt. No, they're going to throw it. Oh, what a hit. And the defense comes through. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. He's on the run. And they make the stop around the 33-yard line. Short yardage situation here. Second down and one. So the scramble goes for nine yards. Catches it, gets out of bounds. So they'll pick up a first down there on a four-yard completion. I think they were expecting a run on that play, Brad, and it allowed the quarterback to throw for just enough yards to get the first down. Passes left, gets it out to the halfback. They'll bring him down at the 21-yard line. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. But they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. And he's taken down at the 14-yard line. throw out to the receiver incomplete and that one probably should have been picked off yeah are you kidding me there's a blanket around that receiver somebody else had to be open from the 14 yard line it's second down tackle at the six yard line finds a man touchdown So he found his way 
his receiver for the score. And the closer you get to the end zone, the more difficult it becomes to throw the football because the field becomes much smaller to work with. But they did a very nice job there to come up with the touchdown. And he adds the extra point. A seven-play, 41-yard drive. And they put up seven points. So the score now, 21-3. They line up to kick this one away. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. From their own 26-yard line. Second down. So we've played two quarters. Georgia in front, 21-3. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. Both quarterbacks remaining upright and healthy. In fact, they haven't been breathed on in the first half. Neither team has allowed a sack and it really speaks well for the relationship that the quarterback has and the feel that he has for his offensive line. No, absolutely. And we always talk about those guys and going out to eat. Well, let me tell you something. They're earning a big, fat steak dinner. And those fat guys get the porterhouses, too. They're not a cheap day. Those guys, they're earning it right now, keeping me up and right, keeping the, keeping the quarterback upright, keeping him clean, you know, not letting anybody hit him. You've seen, you've seen great Hall of Fame quarterbacks turn average when they get popped and when they get hit and when they get you know, beat around a little bit. These guys, they haven't even been touched. So you can, you can uh, go ahead and say, check, please, right over here, because that QB better be taken care of. And the quarterback's calling home, Mom, Dad, please send money. That's it for us here in the studio. What are you going to do in the second half of the game's going on? Yeah, I'm going to kick back and watch all these monitors. We'll keep you up to date on everything going on around the country. Right now, time for the second half with Brad and Kirk. All right, Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. It's a new possession for this offense, so what will it hold? And he hits him hard at the 24-yard line. From their own 24-yard line, it's second down. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Caught in a big hit, he stopped in his tracks. He goes out of bounds at the 33. The punt upcoming, and they're going to come after this one. Oh, excellent punt. He fields it at the 17. Gets to about the 27-yard line. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Makes the catch and look out. He's knocked out of bounds at the 34-yard line. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. He's tackled behind the line. Let's go. 
So the tailback gets two yards on the option. Greenwell to punt. And this one is a beauty. Jackson takes it to 21. Tackle made at the 33-yard line. The quarterback leads the offense back out onto the field as we get set to resume play. Wide receiver screen play. And down he goes at the 47. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 47. He's looking for his man. Guys, I really like what the offensive coordinator is doing here. Throwing it on first and second down will keep the defense guessing. Zips it to the tailback incomplete. From the 42-yard line, second down. Out of bounds at the 40-yard line. Quickly incomplete. Fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Fires it out. He's taken down at the 39. Big stop by the defense. They couldn't get anything going on that last drive. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. Catches it, and that's all. A gain of six. The play action throws the defense just long enough for the quarterback to get the ball to the receiver. It's a nice play. They're about four yards away here on second down. Gets to about the 47-yard line. He's scrambling. Brought down at the 44-yard line. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 44. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. to go long and does. The defender had his hands on it, but it's incomplete. This guy's got to just feel awful, dropping an easy interception in the end zone. The best thing that he could do now is go to his teammates and hope that they're able to get him back up and get ready to play that next play. Nice run up the middle. McBride gains around five yards on the draw play from scrimmage. Let's see if he aims for the sideline and tries to get this thing down deep in their own territory. Yeah. 
This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So they're just about set to get the game going again. Takes it right side for a good game. So it's second down now. They need about four yards to pick up the first. And he's tackled right away. tight end he's tackled at the 47 yard line getting the ball to your tight end and allowing him to make plays in the passing game can really open things up on the outside for your real speedsters from their own 47 yard line first down out to about the 44-yard line. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Tackle made around the 42-yard line. Come out on an empty backfield. Here we go. Mitchell on the give. Gains his way to the 30-yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. hit immediately quick pass the quarterback and his receiver make a great play here and convert on an early down it's second down now and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker looking right intercepted and they'll return this one all the way number 17 makes the interception a well-timed interception there. Well, they're still down by a couple of scores, but the turnover certainly helps their chances. If they score on this drive, they're right back in the game. From the 38-yard line, first down. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. He's got it with room to run. And he's tackled around the 21-yard line. That's good for a game of 17. First down. Room around the corner. Nice run there. He decides to keep it and picks up seven yards. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. And they make the stop around the 11-yard line. First down. Thank <laughs> you. 
He tackles him for a loss. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on the 12-yard line. Gets to about the 11-yard line. A one-yard gain by the halfback. Five wide. Catches it, and he's looking for more. They'll bring him down around the two-yard line. So they're going to go for it here. Now he's scrambling. Got him. They tried to throw for it, but ended up getting sacked. An interception cut this offense last drive short, so I think they're going to be looking for a little more success right here. So much in football is about how you respond to adversity. Moving forward after a turnover is a perfect example of that. And he's taken down around the 25-yard line. yard line. It's first down. And a quick throw. That pass play gets him roughly three yards. This was just a little dump off pass to the halfback, but it was very well defended, keeping them from moving the ball very far downfield. Second and seven. Ball on their own 28. Fires it quickly. Completes. It's the freshman. Tackle at the 43-yard line. time to get the backup some experience as we head to the fourth quarter. George is up by 18. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Up the middle. Makes it out to about the 33. From the 33-yard line, first down. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Steps up. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. Strike complete, and he's down. Third and five situation. Ball on the 28. Out to the tailback, and he dropped it. Yeah. 
It has the distance. And it's good. Georgia is lining up to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. Well, the guys are chomping at the bit down there, waiting for the game to start back up. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. Close to nine-yard pickup there on the slant. That brings up second and one. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. <laughs> Under pressure. You know, at that point, I think, Brad, the quarterbacks are just better off just taking a sack. You have to be very careful as you're feeling pressure to throw the ball just to throw the ball. If you feel like you're not going to be able to make a play and the defense got you, just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. They go to the left for a nice game. That's good for a game of five yards. First down. First and ten. Ball on their own 39. And they got him for a loss. Fires quickly, and it's picked off. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. To the 20. To the 10. Touchdown. Big play. How about the play by the defender? That was a great interception and an even better effort to bring the ball back for a touchdown. He makes the PAT. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So the offense will come back out onto the field, hoping for a little better result than that last pick six. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on capitalizing off the of mistakes. He lets it fly. That was really a remarkable catch. The quarterback didn't throw a good ball, but the receiver made a great play. Now it's first and ten after the big pass play. He's on the run. Slides down to the ground. That'll bring up second and three. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. And down he goes, right around the 22-yard line. From the 22-yard line, first down. He's under some heat. 
Wide open. He drops it. That makes it second in time. He scrambled. He's taken down at the 14. That's good for a gain of eight yards. That makes it third and three. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. He rifles it to the left. He almost had it, but it's incomplete. You know, as a defender, anytime you're not going to have a chance to get to the quarterback, one of the things all defensive coaches try to teach their defense is to get your hands up and try to knock the football away. And that time, that's exactly what they did to set up this fourth down. Nice play to set up first and goal. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Here's a handoff, left side. Touchdown, UAB! It shouldn't have surprised these guys to see the run coming at them, but they just couldn't stop it. And he hits the PAT. Tackle made at the 50-yard line. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. Brought down right around the 42-yard line. So it's second down and about two yards to go. always likes to see a pass broken up, but getting the turnover would have been really big. He fights forward to about the 40. From the 40-yard line, it's first down. the call. More plays like this and the coaching staff is going to need to change up the blocking scheme. You can't allow the defense to play in your backfield. Little handoff. And he's stopped behind the line. Well, I, I think calling the plays, you've got to be aware of this guy. He's making too many plays. And when he's that close to the line of scrimmage, defending the run, not allowing your running back to even get up to the line of scrimmage, you've got to do something to make him pay for that. If he's going to cheat up to the line of scrimmage, if you're calling the plays, listen up. This is a great time to go play action and try to throw the ball right over top of his head. Complete, but out of bounds. Going to lose some ground. That'll make it fourth and 14. Try to change the field position with this kick. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. The offense will come out again, hoping to have similar results as their last drive. I think the defense right now is just sitting back on their heels. They're allowing the offense to kind of dictate things to them. And the one thing is that any defensive coordinator will tell you in the country, you have to be the one trying to dictate things to the offense. So change it up. Try something different. If it's not working, you can't continue to sit back on your heel. From their own 32-yard line, first down. Ready, ready, 
passes to the right. It's picked off. And the quarterback just can't believe it. He really wishes he could have that one back. Every quarterback has passes that he wishes he could have back. However, hey, a pick is a pick, and no one is going to care how bad he wants that one back. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 33-yard line. He's at the 20. Inside the 10. He's all the way home. Touchdown. And he converts the extra point. Line up to kick this one away. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Both teams are playing out the stretch here. You want to get experience for guys who normally don't get in the game and try to avoid injury. He's got the corner. Runs outside for a nice game. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Tackle made right around the 32-yard line. Less than three minutes in the game. Now he tries to buy some time. He's to the 40. Knocked out of bounds at the 45-yard line. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 45. He makes it to the 45-yard line. So we're looking at another third down here. Gets it. He's in space. And he's tackled at the 46-yard line. Let's see if he aims for the sideline and tries to get this thing down deep in their own territory. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. We're late in the fourth quarter. This game has been a blowout for quite some time, and Kirk and I are just looking to make our flights. He gets out to about the 22-yard line. From their own 22-yard line, second down. Up the middle for a nice game. This one's in the books, and our final score, 38-10, Georgia. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.